A-League, Sydney FC have announced that Steve Carisha will be the man to take over Graham Marnold as head coach. Newcastle striker Roy O'Donovan has been handed a lengthy 10-match ban for his ugly challenge on Lawrence Thomas in the dying minutes of the A-League Grand Final. O'Donovan was found guilty of serious foul play by the FFA's Ethics and Disciplinary Committee, who deliberated for three hours on Tuesday night before deciding on the sanction on Friday. He was sent off an injury time during the grand final two weeks ago, with the Jets trailing Melbourne victory by a single goal. O'Donovan's raised boot in the area caught Thomas flush in the jaw with the goalkeeper requiring extensive treatment to see out the remaining minutes of the game. Earlier in the match he had copped an elbow to the eye by victories bees at the Risha and X-rays later showed a fracture. O'Donovan's counsel during the hearing, Simon Phillips, argued that the Irishman had made a genuine play at the ball, but conceded the challenge was reckless. O'Donovan's 10-game band will begin with Newcastle's first game in the FFA Cup in August when the A-League clubs enter at the round of 32. He will be able to serve up to three games in the Cup competition depending on the Jets' progress before the A-League season begins in October. The Jets have appealed the sanction. It's not the first time a 32-year has had the book thrown at him during his time in the A-League. He received an eight-match ban for headbutting Manny Musket in 2015 and last season served a two-match ban for striking Sydney FC's Geordie Bows in the face. He also served a two-match ban in March after being caught by the video referee striking Sydney FC's Geordie Bows in the face during his side's defeat of the Premiers. Watch the 2017-18 Hyundai A-League on Fox Sports every March live in HD with no ad breaks during play. Sign up now greater than.